Hello guys, welcome back to another video and for those who are new, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to show you a simply pilau recipe and this video is dedicated to Stephanie Wendy who requested me to do her a pilau video. So guys, I'll list all my ingredients in the description bar. So feel free to comment and tell me what you think about the video so let's get into it on my counter table i'm having tomato paste garlic paste red onion and white onion on the other side i'm having my pilau mix cumin seeds black pepper pilau masala and turmeric on the other hand i'm having my boiled meat yeah and i'm um, having my soaked rice and i've used this cup to measure two cups of it and on the other side i'm having salt yeah so let's do this so in a pot i'll bring my oil to boil and then i'll add my red and white onion and i'll stir them till they are almost dark brown by doing so we'll be able to achieve our brown color once our rice is ready or once our pilau is ready most people usually wonder like how to achieve the color the brown color so now you know the secret i hope now you know the secret behind the brown color well <laughs> we'll continue stirring our our <laughs> onion till it's cooked so on the other hand i'll take this time to thank all of you like each and every person that took their time and watched my previous videos guys this is at warming i'm so happy thank you so 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 much thank you so much may god bless you i can thank you enough guys what <laughs> In my last video, I almost became emotional, but now actually I am. I am emotional. You don't know how happy I am, like seeing you guys. You love my content. You love what I'm doing. Yeah. And that's all I could ask from you. Please share my video, subscribe, like, comment, like tell me what you want me to improve on because i'm not a professional chef by the way so tell me what do you want like where would you want me to improve tell me yeah if you want me to do maybe a certain menu yeah and i'll gladly do it for you my love so let's continue yeah okay our onions are almost ready as you can see they are now they are almost turned to golden brown um, so i'll keep on stirring so that i can avoid them to burn and as you all know our goal is to achieve the dark brown color and not to burn them down and the difference between dark brown and black it's so slim so and it, i mean it always take it was it always happens so fast so we need to be so keen yeah so that we can't burn them down kabisa well as you all know pilau is a rice dish made with many aromatic spices that adds an amazing depth of flavor to the rice so in that case i'll go in with my flavors and i'll put them into the into my pot as you can see we have achieved the dark color the dark brown color so i'll add them and i'll stir them for 30 seconds well <laughs> so i'll stir my 
my onions and then I'll come in with my meat I will run, I will climb, I will soar I'm undefeated, oh Jumping out of my skin, pull the cord Yeah, I believe it Oh, the past is everything we were Don't make us who we are So I'll dream until I make it real And all I see is stars It's not until you fall that you fly When your dreams come alive, you're unstoppable Take a shot, chase the sun, find the beautiful Dark turning ties to gold And we'll dream Impossible Possible ah. And we'll dream Impossible so guys, initially when I was presenting my ingredients, um, I remember showing you uh, garlic and um, ginger. So the ginger, I used it to boil the meat and the garlic, I'd forgotten to put it before putting my meat. So nothing has gone wrong. I'll just put it together with my tomato paste. Then I'll stir for a while. Then later on, I'll come in with my rice. So let's wait and see.
my rice so well with the spices and with the meat so this moment i'll be coming in with my water so while measuring the water as you have seen i've used the same measuring cup the one which i used to measure my my rice is the same one i've used to measure the water so i usually use the ratio of one is to two so if i used two cups of water of rice i'll come in with four cups of water but in this case since i'd soaked my rice i'll put three cups and a half of water so that it can cook very, so so that it cannot overcook because initially i'd soaked my rice and uh, if you soak your rice it shortens the cooking time as the rice absorbs the water so i'll mix everything together and then i'll cover my rice to simmer for about five minutes then our pilau is ready yeah so let's wait and see Finally, our pilau is ready. So I'll just serve it. Um, and as you all know, pilau is delicious on its own and it can be served as a standalone meal. However, if you want a full Swahili experience, you simply pair it with kachumbari. So our kachumbari is there as well. So I'll just serve it. Yeah. And a glass of cold juice guys <laughs> wow it's so delicious um thank you so much for watching till next time guys bye